Hello and welcome back to the Engage platform on the Quest, the Oculus Quest. So today I'm just going to show you some of the interactivity using a medical training application that we created some years ago on the PC version of the, of the Engage platform. So I'm just going to go in and I'm going to go to the activity. So this activity was created um, with the help of Oxford University. Okay. This experience represents the ETAT Plus guidance for single healthcare providers, birth without meconium, and does not represent the US European guidance. You can interact with objects and answer visual questions using your hand controllers. You will be timed, and your final time will be displayed on screen at the end of the experience. Okay, so here I am in a hospital, and we have some options. We could be a live trainer or a trainee because this is a multi user experience. I'm just going to be a trainee, and we're going to use the automated uh, trainer. This baby has just been born, and you were worried about his condition. What's the first thing you should do? Okay, so we have four minutes to save this baby. Here you can see the baby. Please proceed with the first step. The first thing I need to do is pick up a towel. Correct. Try and stimulate the baby using the towel. Okay. So we're just drying off. You need to rub the baby's back to stimulate it. Turn the baby over, and then rub the baby's back. Okay. Keep rubbing the baby's back. You have dried and stimulated the baby. Now wrap him in a clean towel to keep him warm. So we're just going to wrap him in this towel. You need to assess the baby now. He is warm and dry. Watch for any breathing, movement or crying for 10 seconds. Just listening for any breathing. Do you see any breathing, movement, or crying? No. Correct. There is no breathing, movement, or crying. To open the airway, the baby's head needs to be neutral. Use your controllers to tilt the baby's head into this position. There's no debris in the mouth, and the baby is still not breathing, moving, or crying. You will need to ventilate the baby. Choose the correct size mask and position it correctly on the baby's face. So we have some masks over here. I'm just going to pick up the smallest one. Good. The baby needs to be ventilated now. Select the best technique from the options you can see. So I've done this quite a few times already. I know it's the first one, which is 30 to 50 breaths per minute. Now practice ventilating the baby with one hand holding the mask in place and the other squeezing the bag. Try to keep the correct rate of 30 to 50 breaths per minute and watch the chest rise with each breath. If the chest doesn't rise, you haven't successfully given a breath. So you can see, if you look at the chest, you can see the chest rising. And you have to be nice and steady. Keep going, you're almost there. on wake up I'm just squeezing the trigger to squeeze the bag you have ventilated the baby and now it's time to reassess yes. fantastic Beautiful. you have successfully learned the steps involved in assessing and resuscitating a newborn who isn't breathing well done it's as simple as that